Alright guys, how's it going? So this is a basic simple tutorial to help you if you're trying to work with simple menu on Cyberpunk 2077. As most people know in the current update, as I've seen, there's a lot of posts from a lot of people saying that they cannot get their mod to work. I also had the same problem. There is a small process, and if you don't want to watch this video and you just want a simple ready out for it, I have a post here on Nexus Mods ready to go for you guys if you want to do the process there. You will need Cyber Tweak and the simple mod menu at the same time. You will need both versions of this patch to make sure that the mods currently work up to date. The process for this is quite simple. First, you want to make sure you download both CET's newest version for 2.13. You also just want to make sure you have a copy of Simple Menu just in case, because you may need to use this again in the future. If you already have a copy of Simple Menu 51 Beta in your downloads, perfect. So, what you want to do is then you want to open your directory for your Cyberpunk 2077. For this process, is pretty easy. If you don't know how, I can show you real quick. It takes two seconds. All you gotta do is open your Steam, right click on Cyberpunk, go to Properties, go to its installed files, and Browse. It will bring you right to your game's directory file with zero issues whatsoever. Once you are here, the problem that people are having is inside their bin folder. When they go to the x64 inside bin, and I don't mean this 64, I mean this one. It's the one that will be precursed underneath. Now there is an x64 file inside the bin, but when you go to your mod file here in Cyber Tweaks, the mod's always there. It just for some reason isn't working. Everybody seems to know this. The problem is, is it's not what you're trying to find there. The mod itself is in here. Inside this xc64 program file is the actual game directory that the mods read from. This is where your mod needs to go, because when you go to the plugins here, then you go to Cyber Tweaks, and then Mods, Simple Menu will not be in here, neither any of your other mods that you have for Cyberpunk 2077. So if Simple Menu is not your only mod not working, you can do this process with all your other mods too, and it should work. Initially, I've already done this process, that's why this file is here. But when you look into this version of your x64 mods, it will not be here. This page will be dip completely empty. All you have to do to get this to work is open your simple 51 menu, ignore the add, open the bin, go to x64 underneath it, go to its plugins, find the mod simple menu, and then just drag it over and add it in here. For me, I already have the file in here, so I don't need to do this. You won't not get this if the file is empty. I am only getting this because I already have the mod in there, so you do not have to worry about this page at all. But that's pretty much it. If you are having with updating issues with CET, it's the same thing. You just want to drag your bin file into your directory itself, replacing the original bin file for the game. This is the thing you replace with CET. So you would just drag this file over bin, replace those files, get it updated, get your new simple mod menu, go in X64's plugins, access Cyber Tweak, go to mods, paste just the simple mod menu in there. Nothing else. Do not go and paste the bin file that is entirely here in this page because it will not work. You have to explore this dedicated x64 cyber page to get to mods and get your simple menu. Once you have these all here, you are then clear to go to then close it all, launch the game. The minute you press your asterisk key, simple menu will pop up right away. Zero problems. And if you are still not getting simple menu's configuration file to load when you open your console, press reload all mods and there's a chance it just needs to relaunch the mod independency. And that's it. There you go. I hope that was a simple enough tutorial for you guys. If you have any issues, just please comment below and I will try to walk you through it. Have a good day.